Hey beauty, you guessed it, it is girls night. We are gonna be hanging out talking all of my Amazon home favorites. I started writing down my most current home favorites and I realized that I've literally been buying Amazon home since we moved into this house before I had Raiden, who is now four. So going on five years, I have a lot to talk about. Grab a glass of wine, grab a drink, grab some coffee, get comfy, and let's hang. If you are new to my channel, my name is Deandra, and I post lots of fashion and beauty content, lots of Amazon, lots of Walmart. We're bougie on a budget around here, so if you enjoy that kind of thing and enjoy our girls night tonight. I hope that you decide to stick around and hit that subscribe button down below. Let's go ahead and get started and cheers to girls night. I want to talk about a small sister owned business. They are called RX Los Angeles. They are a candle and home fragrance company. Even though I do buy a lot from Amazon, I do like to support small businesses. And so I was really excited when they reached out to me to do a gifted collab because their products just felt so luxurious and totally worth spending that extra dollar to support a small female owned brand. First, of course, let's talk about their candles. They are vegan and cruelty free. They're made from natural soy wax. They have no added hardeners or stabilizers or any extra ingredients besides the wax and the fragrance oil. They are a two wick candle. The candles are $35 each. They have 55 to 65 hours of burn time and they're made without parabens, phthalates, and pesticides. So you know that you're getting a clean handmade made product they smell amazing i received the box i want to say yesterday or the day before and i can smell these candles with the lid on from the entryway so our entryway is right here it's a pretty open space and then i usually have my doors closed to my office and i can smell the fragrance from there with the lid on it's just insane how fragrant these are i did get three different scents this one is the ohm oh, i just love it it's like a musky but fruity clean scent smells so nice and then this one is the fresh fig it's a slightly earthy masculine scent fresh fig mixed with moss and a touch of patchouli and lemon oh my gosh oh that one smells so good too and the last fragrance that i got is the coco ode it has notes of milky coconut egyptian musk vanilla and ode oh that smells so good too this one's more of a sweet scent obviously with the vanilla if you ask me to choose between my favorite fragrance i don't think that i could i cannot wait to smell these when they're actually on and burning the fact that they're handmade just makes them feel even more luxurious let's talk about the pure fragrance oils these are only five dollars and I know that these are gonna last me for a long time I mean you only need like a couple of drops in a diffuser you can even use these as fragrances just dilute it down a little bit and rub it on you can even use them like on cotton balls to put in the trash can so that your trash doesn't smell bad there's multiple ways to use these but I did just get the diffuser which you just fill up with water and do a couple drops of these this particular diffuser is available on the rxla website i like it because it's nice and small and discreet it does have the different light variations they blend these fragrances themselves and they use them to fragrance all of their products like their candles and their little scented sachets which I will talk about in just a second. Wow, I got a whiff of that one and it was so nice. I got a whole bunch of these actually because I'll get a lot of use out of them. 
So the first one is the white tea scent. I also got the everything, which is one of their top sellers. This is basically all of their fragrances mixed together. It's going to smell like their booth does. The lavender oak. I cannot resist a lavender scent of any kind. And then also the wild grapefruit. Oh my gosh. It smells so good. Did want to get some of these scented sachets. I was thinking that I could use these in my car, Josh's car, and then one of my drawers. Probably end up getting more of these because I really don't feel like three is enough. I kind of want to put them in the bottom of our laundry basket and my lingerie drawer, you know what I'm saying? So I'll definitely be ordering more of these, but for the time, I got the wild grapefruit, fresh fig, and Bora Bora, which I'm actually really excited to smell this one. Ooh, that's so nice. I did also get an all-in-one spray, which you can use as a bathroom spray, a room spray, body spray, pillow spray, car spray, and to neutralize bad odors and so much more. I feel like I can never go wrong with a spray like this to spray on my curtains, on my beds, even just to keep like in the bathroom, you know? The fact that these are all vegan, natural, and handmade just makes me feel even better about spraying them around the house, especially in and where the kids are a lot, as opposed to like a room scent that probably has a lot of additives and is probably toxic and harmful, let's be honest. So I'm really excited that I got this one. I did also get a diffuser because I love me a diffuser. I like to keep them in the entryway of my home, in the bathroom somewhere where people are in and out of. You can actually buy extra reads on their website, which I did do. So I'll probably just use this one to refill some of the reed diffusers that I already have. I really love a reed diffuser. I can just add them to a decorative shelf and count it as decor. It says here that the scent will last up to six months and they do offer refill bottles separately. It's just the cutest little packaging and it's perfect for any kind of decor and I love that. Definitely go check them out if you are wanting to support a small female owned brand. I'll leave everything you need to know in the description box below. Speaking of home decor, let's go ahead and just lead off with home decor that I've purchased from Amazon. I do typically stick with home goods at home and Marshalls for like little knickknacks for home decor but I have purchased major decor staples from Amazon the first that I want to talk about is their olive trees I did purchase this one first with the lights going throughout it and I've had it in my filming room for a few months now I'm absolutely obsessed with it it's gorgeous and it's really cute and realistic looking in real life but it also looks good back here I went ahead and purchased Purchase another more slender one that's a little bit taller it's like a five or six foot I can't remember the branches on that faux tree are real wood but the leaves of the olive tree are actually you know faux leaves with little olives throughout it but the fact that the branches are real wood it just makes a huge difference I have been looking at faux plants at all those home decor places and I've never found any that look as good as the ones that I bought from Amazon look. So I'm very, very happy with those two purchases. I've also purchased an entryway bench. It's a tufted bench with a wooden leg and it's kind of like a half moon because our entryway is rounded. So I wanted something that would fit on that rounded wall and it just looks just so gorgeous there. The pillows that I have on on top of that bench are also from Amazon. They're just pillow covers. And I just think that that setup looks so good. I've had it there for probably since around the time that we moved in. I did just recently purchase an entryway table. So I don't really have that one 
all decorated up yet but the table itself looks so good the wood on it looks good and it was also very affordable around a hundred dollars even the bench was around a hundred dollars and it's just absolutely beautiful josh was able to put it together like no problem in less than an hour i wish that i bought it sooner honestly i don't know i just put off decorating our home for a while and now i'm in this space where i just want to get everything finalized and decorated i don't know why i was putting it off for so long maybe just the thought of it costing so much but again everything that i've bought on amazon is very affordable and so high quality the next thing that i've purchased from amazon that's a staple in my house are my kitchen table chairs and i have a bench on one side so when we moved in we knew we wanted something that was going to be kid friendly because i was seeing all of those chairs that were like tufted chairs like fabric chairs on tables on pinterest and i just knew that was not practical for us and young kids i mean let's be real i need something that i can easily wipe down that's not going to stain that's not going to be hard to clean and those tin chairs they actually are like rounded you know what i'm talking about i did find them on amazon and i want to say the four pack was maybe like around 150 dollars again very affordable they just look really good and they're so easy to clean i don't even care if the kids get like yogurt or spaghetti sauce all over them because i know that i can just wipe it down with a clorox wipe and we're good to go same goes for the bench it's white and it's tin and it's absolutely beautiful it has a wooden bench and i just absolutely love it i have had no desire in the almost five years to ever change those chairs and you know they match the look of my personal home decor style so if those types of chairs don't fit your style i'm sure you can find something that's super affordable from amazon as well we recently redid our entire bathroom when we moved in it was just like a builder grade like huge mirror no backsplash nothing like that and josh and i decided to diy it everything in that bathroom I kid you not is from Amazon except for the paint and the shiplap <laughs> so literally our mirrors our light fixtures the handle pulls on our cabinets and even the new faucets are from Amazon and it just looks absolutely beautiful in my opinion even the shelves in the middle are from Amazon the decor that's on the shelves is not because again I do like to shop for those like little knickknack fillers at home goods because i like to see it before i purchase it if you're doing a diy i totally recommend going to amazon instead of like wayfair or home depot even because there's so many more options that are so affordable it was a very affordable but beautiful upgrade to our bathroom i did also recently do our outdoor area i didn't want to like completely get all new outdoor furniture and change everything around honestly all that I did was buy black and white piping cushion covers. I just put those right on top of my old outdoor cushions. It made a huge difference. And the ones from Amazon are very waterproof. I've been able to spray them down and scrub them off and they still look good as new. I did also get one of those plastic woven outdoor rugs, which I really love because I have been seeing smaller versions of it but i was able to get a really big one i want to say the one i got was like eight by ten and it covers a wide area but it's also one of those that i can power wash down because it is a woven plastic and honestly i've had it out there for about a month and a half now and i have not seen any fading again with the cushion covers i ordered a black with white piping it, they've been in the sun for just as long and i still haven't seen any fading with those either i did share that renovation on tiktok so if you don't follow me on tiktok go check out my tiktok i love our outdoor space right now 
Honestly, even the fan that I have in my outdoor patio is from Amazon. Josh was not happy about that fan because it was like too small, like too close to the ceiling to be able to get his hands in there. So he struggled with it for a while, but honestly it paid off because that fan looks so good out there. It's decorative, but it's functional and I just really love it. I want to get one of those roll down screen shades I don't know if I necessarily need that if you are doing like a DIY pergola and you want some sort of shade they have all of that on Amazon as well I want to talk about literally everything in my office being from Amazon except for this big mirror that is from Wayfair and it was a present to myself for reaching like I don't remember like 40k subscribers so i did splurge on the big mirror which i totally love and i do not regret but this mannequin is from amazon this tree is from amazon and this little clothing rack right here is also from amazon chair is from at home and this little throw blanket is also from Amazon. So literally I buy my whole life on Amazon. I have an organizer little cabinet right here. It's a great organizer. I got that on Amazon. My desk vanity I got on Amazon. The lighted LED mirror I got on Amazon. And even this like spinning organizer that's on my desk even. <laughs> this organizer literally all my furniture in here is from Amazon even in my closet I have those glass gold shelves that are very popular on youtubers backgrounds there wasn't really a cute way to display it out here I decided to keep it and use it to organize my handbags and my shoes inside my office closet again that one was affordable as well I don't remember spending more than $200 for that. I even have a wooden jewelry case that I absolutely love and I had on my wish list from Amazon forever. I wanna say that one was like $80. That one is in my actual closet and it is just beautiful and decorative. I used to have it in my background. When you see it, you'll probably recognize it from old videos. If you watch any of my old videos, anything that you buy from Amazon to organize is gonna be totally worth it. I have bought organizing hangers, which I did a whole video on organizing my closet. I've also bought fridge organizers, pantry organizers. I I have bamboo adjustable organizers, which I really like because they look like custom built-in drawers. They do adjust to fit your drawer so you can fit all of your knives, spoons, forks, and all of that in one drawer. I have the acrylic shelf organizers and those are totally worth it. They sit on the gold shelf right now, but I've also use them at the top of my closet even to organize my makeup inside my drawers i have these little acrylic organizers so everything stays nice and neat i'm a messy girl at heart i'm trying to be tidy and honestly amazon organization products have been a huge help in organizing my life because again i am a messy girl and i'm trying not to be now let's talk about smart home buys when i'm talking about smart home i'm talking about anything that can connect to alexa i did already have the echo dot and the echo show i recently invested in a ring which i absolutely recommend i personally bought the bronze looking one because it just matched all of our hardware in our house it looks beautiful on our front door and i feel so much safer because i can see anytime anyone comes up to my door it gives me a notification it even notifies me if someone is driving by which i just really appreciate and if you've been thinking about a ring i totally recommend it and I would bet money that those are gonna go on sale again during Black Friday and Cyber Monday see what I mean she's literally telling me that someone is at my front door <laughs> I appreciate that so much it's probably Josh 
I love the Echo Show because I can see the ring from the show. I also recently bought smart plugs, so check this out. Alexa, turn off the office. Okay. Alexa, turn on the office. I'm telling you, that little thing has made a huge difference because even with this tree, I was noticing the plug right here and that just like bugs me because I want everything to look nice and neat and pretty and that was just a distraction in my opinion. But if I wanted to hide it behind this mirror, I would have to climb behind this mirror every single time to unplug it and turn it off, which was not safe for anyone especially for this mirror i just have this tree plugged into the smart plug behind the mirror and i don't have to crawl behind there anymore and it's just made my life so much easier those smart plugs did come in a four pack and i only use two i have two extra we did also replace our kitchen faucet with one from amazon which i totally love it because it has two separate faucets and on one of the faucets which is what i usually use to hand wash my dishes it has an led light that will light up blue if the water is cold green if the water is warm and red if the water Water is hot and honestly that faucet was like 50 bucks and it really was easy to install Josh did it in like 10 minutes now let's talk about kitchen gadgets because I've actually bought a lot of our kitchen gadgets from Amazon my Nespresso is from Amazon my ninja coffee pot is from Amazon I really liked that one because it could make tea it could make iced coffee and it brewed not only a small glass of coffee but it also did a whole pitcher i ended up getting the nespresso because i wanted something that was quick and easy and i absolutely love it i just buy the starbucks nespressos from target is such amazing coffee if you're wanting an easy one cup a day situation totally buy the nespresso but if you're wanting something that's going to brew a lot for a whole household get the ninja and i do like my nespresso over a Keurig because anytime that I use a Keurig now I just feel like that coffee is so watered down so if you've been thinking about the Nespresso or a new Keurig try the Nespresso I got a great deal on both of those during Black Friday which is coming up soon so if you're wanting something like that put it on your wish list for Black Friday or Christmas because they do have great deals on Amazon I also have an air fryer from Amazon it is an Amazon brand I love the look of it looking back now i kind of wish that i would have bought a black one because all my other appliances are black but it's white and i still think that it's so cute in that white color it's amazing i use that air fryer for literally everything it's a bigger pan and it does so many things it's a touch screen and it was also very affordable another thing i want to talk about is this wireless shark vacuum mop i've bought wireless vacuums from amazon before i even have like an eureka one or like a name brand one i can't remember here let me look it up how do you spell vacuum okay i'm spelling vacuum wrong <laughs> I put two C's instead of one. But yeah, it's a Eureka Rapid Clean Pro. And honestly, it does not pick up as much as this Shark Vac Mop does. I've shared a whole TikTok about this because I absolutely love it. First of all, I don't have to only buy Shark floor cleaner. Like, you know, with the Swiffer, you have to buy the Swiffer or else you can't really use it because it has just the one bottle that's made for it. With the vac mop, I can literally just open it up and pour any kind of cleaner that I want in there, which I absolutely love. The vacuum picks up just as much as the Eureka one did, and it's just like a little button to take off the mop pad. I don't even have to touch it. I don't have to pull it off or anything. I just press a button and it just drops into my trash can. I recently discovered the triangle corner rug grips that you just stick to the back of your rug and then you stick down on the floor and 
those are totally worth it i purchased them multiple times the rug in the front entryway was starting to curl up and i just put one of those little triangles down and i pressed it down and it's not rolling anymore we're not tripping on it anymore the hallway rug has stayed in place since i put those things down i even ordered them for the rug in the backyard and they've stuck really well let me know down in the comments what your favorite home decor find from amazon has been or what your favorite home decor find is that i've shared today this wine glass is actually also from Amazon. I like the little fade of it because when I have red wine, it just looks like it just fades all the way down. And I love how big and elegant they are. Hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already and definitely check out RXLA for some luxurious home fragrance while also supporting a small female owned business. <laughs> There's Wrangler again, but I just wanna say thank you for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Cheers to girls night and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.